Well, it was time for a good rotary hammer, um, hammer drill. <clears throat> I have a DeWalt hammer drill with the uh, keyed chuck, and it does a good job on most things, but you get into some heavy duty hammer drilling, and I needed something with a little bit more oomph, um, something that could interchange different bits uh, quick and easy. So I went to my local Home Depot and I looked through what they had, their selection. Um, had a lot of nice rotary hammers, but this was the one that I settled on. Now this, uh, this happened to include a four and a half inch angle grinder as well, which I can, I can never have too many of because uh, I use angle grinders quite a bit doing handiwork and carpentry and uh, you know get into all, all kinds of different types of jobs and uh, angle grinders are just handy to have around so anyways I picked up this kit and uh, really like the features I really like the, uh, the ergonomics of it so I've pulled everything out of the package and uh, here's the hammer drill it's got a nice it's got a nice carry case This is just a, a really nice, heavy-duty hammer drill. Um, this thing ought to really, ought to really kick some butt and last quite a while. I like this little push button to adjust the the depth gauge. You push it forward, and then you can slide the the gauge back and forth to get that where you want it. Um, of course, the handle rotates. You know, any position that you want your switch to go from drill to hammer drill to just hammer. Um, the just hammer comes comes in handy if you're going to be using like a chisel type of bit. So instead of rotating it just does the hammer function. And uh, anyway it's got a, a place in the case for your bits which I'll be putting mine into. I've, I've got a lot of uh, bits already so I'm really looking forward to getting this thing out and using it. I'm working on a big project right now that uh, is going to require a lot of a lot of hammer drilling. I've got to run some run some nailers and uh, attach them to a, a cement building or cement walls, and uh, so I'm going to be needing this quite a bit to attach all my runners so that I can attach tin to those. And I'll probably be doing a video of that pretty soon, showing showing the process of uh, how I'm doing that, and um, might give you some ideas if you're going to be doing the same type of project. So, anyway, this is just basically the unpackaging. I haven't got to use it yet, but I'm looking forward to using it. I think this is going to be a a really nice set, but especially the uh, the hammer drill. So. It's a one inch AVT rotary hammer, and uh, again, it includes the four and a half inch angle grinder, which is nice. You know, I didn't buy it because of that. Um, I bought it based on the, the functions, the uh, reviews that I had read online, and uh, the ergonomics of it. You know, I picked up each one of them and kind of looked over the functions, and this was the one that I just liked the best. So it does accept. The SDS plus bits. I don't know if that's going to focus. Maybe. There we go. SDS plus bits. And I'll show you some of those. I've got a few here in my truck already. So that's this type of, of bit, which is the you know pretty standard type. Uh, this is one of the chisel attachments. <clears throat> that I bought for this <clears throat> where you would just use the hammer function and then this is one of the uh, masonry drill bits and this is where you'd want to use your hammer drill function so anyway I uh, hope that helps if you're in the market for a new hammer drill uh, not sure what you want to get I'll be doing a, uh, a video of this hopefully in the upcoming future showing it in use and uh, let you know what I think of it. Thanks for watching.